Greetings and salutations, YouTube land. Preval back again with another unboxing video. Today I have for you a wrestling pickup from Heroes Hideout. If you watch my videos, you've probably seen them a few times. I've done a couple of higher value mystery boxes from them. This, however, is not a mystery. They like to do these pop drops occasionally where they'll put a bunch of Funko Pops up on their site at once and it's kind of a cluster. Some of them they only have one or two of and it's a rush to get them. They put a ton of signed WWE Pops up. I will say it wasn't great the way it was run. Instead of having the autograph ones up separately they were included with the normal ones, so all of the prices were wonky. They had, like, a Vince McMahon signed one that looked like it was, like, eight bucks. Because that was just, like, the common pop, but when you actually tried to buy the autograph one, it was, like, 500 Which, obviously, value-wise makes sense. You're not getting a Vince autograph for eight bucks. But it just causes a lot of confusion and headaches. I had a Bray Wyatt one that the site crashed and I lost before I could check out. So that was a bummer. But I ended up emerging out of the fray with this guy. Now this had the weirdest shipping I have ever seen. I actually have the tracking here because I cannot do this justice. I then live in New Hampshire. This came from New York. Usually it's like two days. This took close to two weeks. And here is the shipping on this. Started in Albany. Arrived in uh, Springfield, Mass. At the distribution center. Left the distribution center. Went to the Providence Road Island distribution center. For no apparent reason. Left there. Went to the New Hampshire distribution center. Left there. Back to Providence, Rhode Island. From there back to Springfield, where it departed Springfield and suffered a processing exception, where it proceeded to sit for close to a week before I kindly contacted them, kind of saying, what the heck's going on? And the next day, it finally showed up at my doorstep. Quit the journey for this little guy for a trip that I could have done in like five hours. Alright, are you ready to see this and if it was worth it? Alright. Let's get ready for the unboxing. Oh, thank you. So this is kind of my, one of my uh, second choice ones. I had actually tried to get this one from High Spots from a recent signing. However, I dilly-dallied a little too long placing my order. And they actually sold out early, which usually doesn't happen, but just my luck. However, from high spots, this was going for a hundred. I think I paid sixty something for this. It was kind of a weird price. Let me see if I got it. Yeah, with shipping, it ended up being like sixty nine twenty seven. So, got a good deal. Oh. Shipped in bubble wrap. And I think it's a pot protector. That is a plus. I've gotten some stuff from them not in protectors before. Probably is weary of that. There I go. Former WWE Champion, recently unemployed, the monster amongst men, Braun Strowman. This is JSA, uh, JSA certified. Signed an orange paint pen, which is a little weird, but hey. Actually, can make out his name, too, so that's a plus. 
yeah, really good deal on this. Really happy. Bummed I missed out on Bray, but glad to add him to my hopefully doesn't collapse pile of autographed goodness behind me. So if you're looking for some uh, pops and you're feeling lucky, uh, follow Heroes Hideout. They've, I don't know how often, at least once a week I see different drops, not all autographed, but some are. And there are a few that I could have gotten in this that I didn't, and honestly I'm regretting now. Demons to Breaks. Not that Vince McMahon one, though. Not paying that much for his autograph. At all. <laughs> Alright. So we go. A very nice pickup. He came in very good shape. Despite the journey it went on, I was actually getting very afraid that it had gotten crushed or something, and they were trying to get it back to Hero's Hideout or something. Yeah, thank you, Heroes Hideout. Bite me post office. If you enjoyed this, shoot me that thumbs up. Anything to say if you've gotten involved in any of their drops, got anything awesome? If you sniped that Bray Wyatt on me? Or any questions about Heroes Hideout? Shoot away, you know I love hearing from you guys. Ding, that bell so we notified whenever my videos go live. Hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any videos. So always be excellent to each other. Party on, dudes. And if you got to pick a tag team partner, a kid from the audience is always your best bet.